All right, so we're gonna demonstrate uh, shin splint taping. The most important thing on shin splint taping is to find out what side, whether it's medial or lateral side of the tibia that they have pain. And what we wanna do is we wanna pull that muscle back onto the tibia. So Richard has lateral shin splint pain all the way along here. Then we wanna pull this muscle onto the shin. So we wanna flex the calf. So we'll have him stand on something underneath his heel just to flex that calf so it makes a little tight, put some pressure on that for me. So it actually flexed your calf, stand on it for me. There you go, now it's flexed. And pre-wrap it if they have hair. If they don't have hair, it's better to do it right on the skin if they don't get irritated by the tape. We're gonna do a couple anchor strips, nice and loose at the top. Just around the calf, don't pull any tension on that. One at the ankle as well. And so I wanna make sure that the pain is within those two strips. I'm gonna do a vertical anchor strip a little further over because I want to be able to get that muscle so around the lateral side and one anchor strip here on the medial side as well okay so once I have those anchor strips down now I'm actually going to start pulling the muscle onto the tibia so I'm going to go ahead and angle always going from painful side to non-painful side so for him it's going to be from lateral to medial make an X and then overlap by half pulling tension so it's nice and tight. But the whole point of this is to pull that muscle onto the tibia. So, like that. Overlap by half every time, so it is a good thick one. Layer of tape, and then that'll be effective. And we're almost done. We've got a few more. And I'm making sure that all my tape stays on the anchor strips. It doesn't go past the anchor strips. Otherwise, it makes it for a sloppy looking tape job. All the way up, make sure I cover everything. One last one. I'll do one more. Alright, so one more like that. Should be nice and tight. So not to be wrinkled, iron it out. Go ahead and do anchor strip, hold all those down. That side. Anchor strip on this side. I'll cover up all those tape ends. Make sure you stay on that, flex that calf good for me. Just go all the way around. And then I'll have one at the bottom, last strip. Then anchor ankle, hold all that in place. Okay. All right, so then that helps to resolve pain from shin splint taping, but it doesn't actually fix the problem that's going on with shin splint taping. With shin splint taping or with shin splint pain, we want to make sure that we have good arch support. That's going to be the most effective to reduce the pain. All right.